Truth, Money, and Freedom podcast. Welcome to Truth, Money, and Freedom. Today is Friday, the 21st of February, 2020. Hey gang, um, I'm sorry I haven't put out a video lately, I've been too busy, but uh, one of those reasons was two days ago, um, as you guys know, on the 19th, a contingent of us went up and uh, actually did some shoe leather uh, activism up in the uh, Missouri House and Senate and talked to a bunch of folks. And I'll tell you what, between that and, and of course the enormous amount of ground you know, boot support from those making phone calls and emails. I have something kind of historic to report to you guys. This is important. And we're in the state of Missouri now, and this has to do with the Second Amendment Preservation Act, you know, which is something I've been talking about quite a bit on the channel. Um, we have now 82 co-sponsors in the House of Representatives for Jared Taylor's bill, the Second Amendment Preservation Act, that's Bill HB 1637. Uh, let me tell you why this is historic. Number one, uh, we're not sure. We don't think any bill, any bill ever in Missouri has ever had this many co-sponsors, number one. Historic, number one. Number two, um, this, this bill almost had 82 even before it was assigned a committee. Even before it was assigned into a committee. Number three, we don't even have a hearing scheduled yet, and we already have enough yes votes with the co-sponsors to actually pass this bill in the House. All three of these are historic, and it's all thanks to all of you guys. Every one of you who cares about this issue that's been calling and emailing, thank you very, very much. We have made tremendous progress. And, uh, and by the way, everyone in Missouri, not just people listening to this channel, there are others that probably have no idea this channel even exists that are helping to make this happen. Uh, certainly with Aaron Doerr in the Missouri Firearms Coalition, uh, he's got a lot of folks, you know, that email and make phone calls, you know, for him as well. But the grassroots support is growing for this. And although we're still not out of committee in the Senate, we're hoping that'll happen very, very soon. We got some assurances that uh, that that's moving forward. Uh, I just wanted to say that this is so historic, in fact, that people uh, like, for instance, my senator Eric Burleson, my representative Jared Taylor, the chairman of the Transportation and Public Safety Committee Doug Libla, and the chairman of the General Laws Committee Dean Plocker. That's in the House, by the way. The General Laws, where this bill is right now, they all understand that not only is everyone in Missouri watching them, but there's a lot of folks around the United States watching this whole process as our language from our bill, the Second Amendment Preservation Act, is being put up in states all over the United States. Currently, I believe there's nine states with the Second Amendment Preservation Act actually um, you know, in the legislative process in these states. And uh, I can name them all off. But, you know, I've done this before, but Kansas has now been added. So we call it SAPA Light, you know, because their bill isn't quite as strong as ours. But it doesn't matter. It's, it's a step in the right direction. This movement is bigger than the eight-state movement to form, um, you know, basically a Second Amendment preservation region of the United States. So the Second Amendment Preservation Act is definitely getting attention. So I want to say thank you to any of the YouTubers who have been bringing attention to this, not only to the state of Missouri, but the other states as well. And I, once again, I literally am asking anyone who lives in the state that has the Second Amendment Preservation Act in your legislative docket, get behind it and start working it. Start spreading the word. Start getting co-sponsors. Start whatever you have to do um, to get this done. This is a big big revolution that started now remember now guys this is a form of nullification i meant for all of my anarchist friends out there or volunteers friends this is nullification of the second amendment from the federal government the states say no we decide we decide what the second amendment you know represents in our state not you not the federal government we don't want any more of your tyranny here that's what these the, the second amendment preservation act is really all about so 
I just wanted to uh, update you guys very quickly on this and let you know um, there's an enormous amount of momentum we're moving forward and uh, I'll give you guys an update on this very very soon also um, I've talked to Ron Calzone and he is creating a, um, a witness form for the house so I should have a video on that very soon it'll be a separate video a short video um, that I'll put up basically to help people fill out the form and we'll share it all over social media um, so at any rate right now there is no official call to action at this moment we get to rest for a few days but there will be a call to action here real soon and that uh, the first one I can think of right now will be the witness forms for the house but I just wanted to update you guys it's still moving forward thank you all for making the phone calls we have already made history in the state of Missouri with co-sponsorship and the early adoption and co-sponsorship even before committee assignment and also even while we're in committee and there's no hearing scheduled yet um, we have more than enough votes to actually pass this anyway this is a huge victory and pat yourself on the back everyone for all of you who made phone calls and sent emails you know who you are you guys help make this happen this is an enormous enormous uh, feather in your cap this is activism right here this is actually getting a state government to start recognizing your God-given rights from the Second Amendment that the federal government seems to want to you know nibble away at and take away from so once again my call out is to other states that have this Oklahoma Wyoming Mississippi Alabama Kansas, West Virginia, South Carolina. You guys need to get on this bill if you're in those states or if you know someone in these states, let them know this is happening so they can actually start a grassroots movement to get this done this legislative year in those states. This is very, very important. So at any rate, I just wanted to give you the update. I'll have another update, hopefully at the beginning of next week about this, but I am putting out more videos uh, hopefully today but definitely this weekend I've got a lot of things I got to say about the economy right now guys there's a lot of stuff going on and I haven't been paying a whole lot of attention because I've been working this real hard but there's a lot of important information you guys need to know thank you for tuning in to truth money and freedom we know your time is valuable and when you choose to spend some of that time with us we're honored so thank you again you guys have a wonderful day may God bless you all mm -hmm.